Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're going to show you how to set up an Amazon Alexa smart plug. So we've got our device here, and this will then allow you to control whatever you plug into it with Alexa voice commands. You can also remotely control this from your smartphone if you want without a voice command needed. So the first thing that we're going to need to do is go ahead and open up the Alexa app. If you haven't already done so, you need to set up and install that on your phone. So we've already done that and we're gonna click in the lower right hand corner on the devices tab. Now we're going to click in the upper right hand corner on the plus symbol to add a device. So it has different options here and we're going to click on add a device, this top option here. It asks, which device would you like to set up? So we're going to scroll down. We are setting up a plug. So we click on this and we have an Amazon brand Alexa smart plug. So we go ahead and click that top option. It says, connect your Amazon plug to Alexa. To set up your Amazon plug, the Alexa app may ask for permission to access your mobile device, Bluetooth, camera, or location. We're going to go ahead and click next. Now on the back of this device, there is a barcode that we need to scan using the app. So I'm just gonna click scan barcode, and now I'm going to scan the barcode that's located on the back of the Alexa smart plug. And we're going to go ahead and plug in the device. It says looking for your Amazon plug. So once you scan it with the barcode, you want to make sure that you plug this into the device. It says Amazon plug connected. First plug has been added to your Alexa account. Next, let's continue to set up. So we're going to click next. It says add your plug to a group. I'm going to skip this for now. It says first plug is set up and ready to use. To control it, say Alexa, turn on first plug. Now we're going to show you how you can use the Alexa smart plug with voice command. So I've got a little night light here that we're gonna plug in, but you could plug in a lamp or any other device that is appropriate to be plugged into an outlet like this. So we're going to go ahead and test it out. We've got our device unmuted over here and let's see if it works. Alexa, turn on first plug. Alexa, turn off first plug. So you can see that the Alexa voice commands work for the Alexa smart plug. Now we had the name of first plug, that was what was automatically set up in here, but you can change it to whatever you want this device to be named. So I'm gonna go ahead and click done over here. And then you can also see that if you have an Alexa device with a screen, you can also turn it on and off from the touch screen. Now I could also go over here to plugs and I could look for this device and I'm going to scroll down and first plug is the device and I could turn it on and off from the Alexa app. Now let's say I wanted to change the name of this device. I just go up here and I click on the settings tab and now I can click on edit name and let's just call this one Nightlight. Now we click done. Now, if I want to control this with an Alexa voice command, I just say, Alexa, turn on nightlight. Alexa, turn off nightlight. So thank you for watching this video on how to set up an Amazon Alexa smart plug. If you like this, please give us that thumbs up, subscribe, or click any of the links below. Now, we'll also have a link to this Amazon Alexa smart plug. Now, there is one disadvantage if you decide to go with this smart plug is that it does not work with Google Home. If you want something that has compatibility with both Google Home and Alexa, you're gonna need to look at a different option. However, if you only use Alexa voice assistance, this is a great option. And if you ever wanna turn it on and off manually, there is a little button on the side here that you can turn it on and off manually if you don't have your phone with you or you're not near an Alexa device to use an Alexa voice command. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.